Dave Shea's guest at Boston Garden, Ron Francis, who had one of the six Pittsburgh goals tonight. David? All right. Uh, thank you, Tommy. Uh, Ron, you guys uh, started fast, uh, had a little trouble through the middle part of the hockey game, and then came on strong in the third. Well, you know, we kind of anticipated them coming out flying early, and, and uh, you know, we're ready for that. We got ourselves a lead, and then their shorthanded goal kind of took a little bit of the wind out of our sails. But, uh, you know, we battle struggled and, and came back with a big victory. What do you feel was the key tonight to you guys being able to come back after losing that early lead? Well, you know, I think uh, just the, the fact that we knew we were in a, in a pretty good position after the first period. It was still a 2-2 hockey game, and, uh, you know, anybody's game. And then same thing at the end of the second. It was whoever, uh, you know, got the chances in the third. And I think a big turning point was when, when they scored the goal to tie it up. Yager came right back down and scored a big goal for us again give us right back the lead. You came up with a big one midway through the hockey game. Let's take a look at it and have you comment on huh? it. Well, it's just a, a face-off play where it goes back to the point and I'm trying to get loose and go to the front of the net and, uh, you know, Jimmy uh, Pake just gets a shot on net and uh, the rebound's laying for me there and uh, I just tried to slide it back by the short side. Now that uh, you've had a chance to go through a training camp, you went through a, a, a dandy of a couple of months <laughs> when you first joined the hockey club, but now that you've gone through a training camp, you, you're totally comfortable being in Pittsburgh? Yeah, you know, I, I felt really, really comfortable when the time I got there. Uh, you know, Bob Johnson, coach at the time, called me in, sat me down. Uh, you know, was very good, explained, uh, you know, what he wanted me to do and my role with the hockey club. And, uh, you know, obviously I'm not going to be a number one center with Mario Lemieux there, but, uh, you know, I can contribute in other ways. And I'm, I'm very uh, happy with the role and feel very comfortable now in Pittsburgh. Of course, in Hartford, you were the number one center. You were counted on to do so many things. Uh, you feel more comfortable being number two? Well, you know, I, I think there's still pressure on yourself. I mean, as a professional athlete, you want to perform to the best of your ability every night and that's what I want to do but uh, certainly I think on this hockey club it's a lot different because uh, the scoring distribution you know goes from Lemieux to Stevens to Recky to Yager to